Welcome travelers to, uh, well, as you saw in the description, SevTech Ages. Yay. Oh, what we got over there? Um, that looks scary. We're going to go this way. So, hi and welcome. I'm Slider Havoc and welcome to my game. So today we are starting another, 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 another mod pack. This is the third one in a group of, you know, like a series of mod packs that I've been taking a look at. This one right here is the one I'm most excited about. So let me start off by saying right now, 30 seconds in, guys, this is going to be an hour long episode. I'm already saying it. We're going to keep this one an hour long episode. And I'm going to go ahead and kind of preface some of the stuff with you. Once we get started, I want to explain kind of what I plan on doing with these series and kind of asking for your guys' input. So without further ado, we're going to dive in and then we'll come back and explain the series later. Those just, that looks really cool over there, but I have a feeling that's just dangerous. That's, that's all I just, I just feel danger over there. So we're not going to go mess with that right now, but I will open up our advancement screen to kind of see what we got to get going. So uh, to complete the tutorial, complete the advancement to craft a work stump to move. Well, what is a work stump? Okay. Looks like this one's kind of grayed out. So let's kind of follow that one. Craft a flint hatchet so you can cut down a tree. Now, is that the same recipe as it is for normal primal core? Flaked flint, unfamiliar item, and stick. Okay. Will this give me some unfamiliar items? Yes, it will. All right. Um, I can't walk straight. There we go. Did I just see something fly by my screen? I could have sworn I just saw something fly by. Maybe there's something funny in my tea, but I could have sworn I just saw something fly by my screen. All right, so is that the same recipe just to do this? Yes. Okay, cool. There's one of those. Um, and if this is problem cord, that means I got to beat leaves, right? To get sticks? Yes, there we go. All right. All right, two sticks. That's a good start. Now, we need to go find some gravel. Oh, perfect. Some right here. This is just a great place to start. So I guess while we're doing some of the digging and stuff like that, I can kind of explain. So my goal with the series is kind of like, how can I say it? I want to know which one you guys want to see the most of basically, right? Because we're already starting, um, you know, two other series and we're going to be doing this one. And I'm sure you guys have a favorite or a least favorite or a I don't care about it. And so if there's one you guys want to see more of, like if you want to see one every other day and then kind of alternate with the other two. So like we could do one on Mondays, one on Tuesdays, one on Wednesdays and do like a three day rotation. <clears throat> or we could do um, like one on Monday, and then one of the other two on Wednesday or Tuesday, then the first one again on Wednesday. So like one, like A and then B or C, A, B or C, A, B or C, like that. Like, I don't know what kind of sounds interesting to you, but I am interested in why I can't make flint. Um, that's probably a block of flint. That's why it's unfamiliar. Uh, grass five. Well, you know what? Let's go and see if this has anything to do because it's probably going to. Okay, mesh your flint. Okay, cool. So we need to make a mesh. That is two plant twines and two sticks. Okay, so two plant twine, two sticks, and we've got that. And then this with this gives us flint. All right, cool, cool, cool. Awesome. Now let's go get uh, another stick. Hey, where'd you go? Get over here. Just grab up a couple more sticks here. So yeah, so let me know what you guys want, uh, what would you would like to see? Like if you want to see this one more often or if you want to see the other ones more often, just kind of give me a heads up. I'm, I'm genuinely curious and I, I might record and set everything up accordingly. So we'll, we'll see how that goes. But for right now, as it is right now, I'm going to kind of keep them on a one by one. So uh, tomorrow um, we'll be releasing the next episode of Modern Skyblock. So that's how that's going to go for the time being. All right. So let's make our flint hatchet here. Go ahead and just do it that way. And you guys look that flint and stick. Perfect. Flint hatchet. Got you. All right, cool. So we've got that achievement done. Ooh, and it's all purple now. And now 
uh, punching tree hurts and you won't get wood from using your hands, use the appropriate tool, which is why we just made that. So let's start getting some wood here. What is this? Is this eucalyptus? I don't want to break that tree right now, mostly because I don't want to have to deal with the leaves. Cavemen hate trees. Well, that's good. All right. Get a couple saplings. Now, do sticks drop from the decaying leaf? No, it looks like unfamiliar items do. But not sticks. Okay, so we'll get a couple sticks off of this tree right here. Give it a little smacky smack. Maybe we'll make ourselves like a, a little flint sword and flint pickaxe maybe. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Let's get a little bit of resources here and go back to the book. <clears throat> okay, so that opened up some new stuff too. So we've got chopping block. Use a log to craft a chopping block. Place a log or plank on the chopping block. Use it axe to cut planks. Oh, okay. So this, okay, so this right here, let me explain. This is why I was interested in this mod pack. The, what I read about it basically says it's the way Minecraft should be, right? In the way that it's not like, you know, just take a freaking log, make it into four planks, make the four planks into crafting, like quit crafting. Like I've got a chopping block now, right? And so basically if I put this here and then I beat up on it a little bit and that's how I get my planks and I only get two planks. Except that's an unfamiliar item, so that that could be hard to build with and stuff. Um, well, let's see what else we got. Um, no crafting tables yet. Use a work stump instead to craft these items. Place them on a table in the correct pattern. Use a crafting rock to right-click the recipe into existence. When you're finished, place the rock in its home. Okay, so we need a stump. S-T-U-M-P, stump. A stump is... A chopping block and a log. Okay, so we'll do this and put you like that, and we got a stump. And apparently, that is a big achievement. <clears throat> <clears throat> Unlock stage zero mob. Unlock stage zero. Okay. Well, alrighty then. So then it said something about the rock. Is it this thing right here? Crafting rock. Yeah. So a rock just becomes a crafting rock. Um, I've seen rocks around here. I've seen rock. There's a rock right there. Can I pick you up? Yes, I can. And then you give me a crafting rock. Awesome. Cool. So, I don't think I have any crafting recipes to make right now, but that's cool. We're, we're getting going. So, ooh, that opened up a lot of stuff there. All right. So, storage. Let's let's take a look at storage. Storage, storage could be something that gets started on. I don't want to start too late on storage. So, planks and a rock. And if I can't put these in my hand because it keeps falling out. Oh, I can now. Okay. So let's go over here, get some wood. And we'll get like another rock or two to make up some chest. Because I am going to do my best to stay highly organized. And I don't know how many of you are laughing at that idea right now. But I'm going to try my best to stay highly organized. I, yeah, I find it funny too. I hope you're laughing at me because I'm laughing at myself. It's going to happen though. It's going to happen. Um, let me grab one rock, two rocks. Any more rocks? Any more around here? I'm going to have to clear out some of this grass so I can kind of see around. But two should be good for right now. I think two should be okay. So two of these. Oh, no. That's really not what I meant to do. Um, is it like a store? Yeah, okay. I can put that there. Let's, let's just... I don't need this many of these. I know that for sure. There we go. So just let them kind of die out in there. I need regular rocks. That's what I need. That's part of the crafting recipe. There's a couple more up here. And then we can go make a couple of these chests. I probably want to get a little bit more wood so I can kind of... Where's the sun at? Is that going down? Yeah, we need to hurry up and get a place to stay for the night. So let's put you here. Awesome. I'm going to do this. I hate when it's like stuff's all over the place. Um, okay. All right. Yeah, I don't want to get stuck out in the darkness. I My goal is to actually stay alive. Like, I'm not going to be overly, you know, cautious per se, but I want to stay alive. I don't want to die. I really don't want to be running around to like respawns and stuff like that and whatever. Uh, so I need this little rock, right? And then do I left click? 
It looks like it. Okay, cool. That's actually really cool. I like that. See, that, I mean, I'm not going to say it's necessarily realistic per se, but I like the idea of it. Okay, so let's put some building materials away. Put you there. You there. Um, we'll put some saplings. Olive tree. Okay. Oh, now I can see that's olives. And you there. I just want to keep my inventory <gasps> as pretty as possible. Not get the hiccups for the time being. <gasps> okay. And let's take a look at a few other achievements we can do before the sun goes completely down. You know what? No. Let's go get some wood. I'll build up a little shed around us. And then we can kind of take a look at some stuff and hopefully not die. I don't, I saw it said level, you know, eight zero mobs unlock. So I'm figuring the mobs are going to be coming after us soon enough. So let's make sure we are as safe as possible for our first night. And then we'll kind of take a look at some more of the achievements. But yeah, um, also let me know. And I, I mentioned it before. I want to do an hour episode for this one. Um, I want to know if that's something you guys want to see more of, like more hour episodes, or if you think half hour is good, kind of keep it at half an hour. Like, I'm totally up to your opinions on that one. I just think with as different as this one is, I think the more time I can put in, the better, like the more I'll enjoy it. And yeah, and maybe not, maybe half an hour would be more than enough. Maybe after this, this first few levels or whatever, it's not going to be nearly as you know, different is I think it's going to be. And if that's the case, then, you know, we can just kind of do normal half hour episodes or whatever. I think I just heard a zombie. All right, let's get over here to the chopping block and make ourselves a quick little house. So, okay, quickly, quickly. I wish I had like a, like an auto tap button instead of just holding it. Okay. Maybe I could have used dirt. Or maybe I could have dug in. Hmm. That could have been an idea. I mean, we're not doing a big house to begin with. <clears throat> this is literally just going to be shelter for the first night. I'm hoping that nothing's going to spawn immediately. Because I'm not really moving. So I should have kept this whole area, you know, pretty well blocked off. So. All right. So let's go like this. Just enough to wrap everything that we have so far, like so. Oh, that's is that a wolf? Is that a woofy? Do I don't have any bones right now? That'd be awesome. I do like. I think it's the movement monitor. I forget what the name of the mod is that lets you just kind of like walk up and run up and stuff like that. I forget what the name is, but I like it. It makes me run smoothly. All right. Need a little bit more wood. And I broke my axe. I still have plenty of materials to make another one. Bingo, bingo, and bingo. I got used to that recipe on um, Lost Souls. So that one I've got kind of memorized pretty well. And I wonder if torches are possible. That's what I should probably take a look at is getting some light around here. Let's see, torches. Got a couple of them available. Um, lit fiber torch, unlit fiber torch, totem torch. So a lit fiber torch. Um, oh, that's just a fiber and a stick. I can do that. Wait, is it that fiber or? No, it's that one right there, okay. So, why, okay, I was like, why can't I do this? One, two, three. Oh, and it only makes one at a time. Well, that, that kind of stinks. Um, how do I light them? How do you light them? Um, I, psh, let's, finish get, let's finish getting these walls up first. Let's pick that bad boy back up and see. I mean, we've got to obviously have a way to light them, so. Oh. Um, here we go. Good enough. 
I guess if skeletons come up, I can kind of hide over here in the corner, I guess. So good enough. Good enough for government work. All right. So what else do we need to do? <laughs> We've got... I'm trying to follow this path. Okay, so I did all this up here. Then I did all the purple ones down here. This branches, this. Okay, so we can do um, a flint axe. Uh, yeah, flint pickaxe. Uh, left click a bone on a block like cobblestone. Okay, but I don't need bones yet. Create a fire. Uh, hold a fire stick in each hand and click on the block to create fire. Interesting. If I put these uh, right click on fire source, or lit torch. Oh, okay. Okay. So if I, if I make those fire sticks, how do I make those fire sticks? Two sticks. I can do that. One, two. Oh, I got another one. Cool. Now, how does this work? Hold in both hands and right click on a block. Set to fire at block looked at. Oh, okay. Interesting. So like this, I should be really careful. I'm gonna put this right back out after I light my torches up. So let's try this, so. Okay. Cool, those are all lit now. Oh, perfect. That's, that's a really cool little freaking way to do it. I like that. I am digging this so far. This is, this is pretty cool. Okay, let's move on. Um, use some rocks, twine, and sticks to make a fire pit. Okay, fire pit. Oh, I just had fire in there. Rock, sticks, and twine. Three rocks, a twine, and three sticks. Um, I don't have any rocks. We can dig down a little bit, can't we? I guess we'll just go this way. Well, it's done eventually, right? Yeah. Oh, you know what? I don't have... Can I make a pickaxe? That's, that's the recipe I need. Um, flint pickaxe. Two to oh, perfect. We can do that. And that's going to be up here on this guy. I have a feeling... Oh, I need that little rock thing, please. There we go. And I don't have enough of you. Um, how do I get more of you? Let's... Oh, man. I really don't want to be messing around at night. Let me go put these torches out a little bit. Like right here. Oh, what? Who are you shooting at? Why are you shooting at me? Let me fix that real quick. Who are you? What are you doing? I can't craft if you're there. Um, what do I do? This? Ha, cool. There we go. All right. So I need you. And you and you. And so it was like that. No. It was that, 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 there, and there. I think that was right. Perfect. Cool. We got a pick. All right. Let's get a little bit deeper here. Ooh, we got some stone now. We are definitely heading in the right direction. And I believe, I believe, if I remember correctly in uh, Lost Souls cobble goes into rock I believe it does perfect so we need that and I'm going to need more of that twine to make the fire pit I'm going to try to do this like hiding over here alright there we go there we go lots of this fiber stuff this is, I'm, I'm digging this real quick. Oh, oh, hey, hey. Um, does the ax work as a weapon? Whew. This is, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Can I jump up anywhere? I can't jump up anywhere. I don't see him. He's gonna be right here. Is that a spider over there? I think that's a spider over there. I don't know where he went. Just don't bother me anymore. Okay. Okay. Cool. So we were trying to make the fire pit, which was three rocks, um, one of these twines. I, you know, what? I'm just gonna make them all. I I don't think I've ever seen a recipe with just the small part. So. <clears throat> Got you. 
you have any good loot drops? Nope. All right, so we'll put you back there. I should probably close this hole. I really should. Um, cool, six blocks. I didn't even realize I still had six. Ah. Okay, there we go. I feel much safer now. I feel much safer. The roof's open, but I feel safer. Okay, I, I yeah, we're good. Let us do this. So it was one, two, three rocks. It was this and three sticks. Was that it? Was that not it? What was the recipe? Fire pit. Fire pit. Three rocks, a fiber, and three sticks. Does it take longer because it's a little bit more umpy? Hold on. What's going on here? What's going on here? Do I, is this going to be so annoying as to tell me I got to do it on this side? Do I have to do it on like the front side? I just kind of noticed that those rocks were kind of placed like that. And so I'm thinking maybe I've got to do it from the front. And if that's the case, I'm going to move this table a little bit. Uh, and then you. That's, that's kind of annoying. I mean, whatever, you know, no big deal. So we're going to put you down right here like that. So that way I'm always facing the front if we're working on you. And let's pick the stump up and get it out of the way. And we'll put you right here for right now. That should work. Let's go ahead and put some of these things away. So I don't want my inventory to get all crazy full. So we're going to continuously stay organized. <laughs> like that will ever happen. Um, you go there. And you go there. And I guess I'll just hold on to this guy. All right, so fire pit. I'm not sure what the fire pit does, but we'll put it right there in the corner. And let's see what that does. So the fire pit. Use some rocks, twine, sticks to make a fire pit. Use typical fuel items to light it and insert items to be cooked. Oh, just cooked. Okay, so can I make, if I take cobble, can I put cobble in there? It doesn't look like it. Um, and I don't have any food items to test out. So I guess we'll just drive on. Um, hot grill. Upgrade your fire pit with something a bit more great. The grill needs a heat source below it, such as fire, to properly cook. Well, that could be dangerous in this house here, so we might want to do that elsewhere. But it's daytime now, so we can get going. Okay, so let us look at the recipe for the grate. Um, grate. No? Oh, grill. Huh, there was a pun in there. That's where I got grate from. Um, it looks like I need three... Sto oh, stone, not cobblestone, and three rocks. Okay. Um, so how do I get cobblestone or stone? Here we go. Let's look up stone. Stone is made by crafting. Smelting, obviously, but I can't smelt yet. Um, chisel, obviously, these are all useless. Can't do a Stoked Crucible yet. Clay kiln. I think I saw that image right there. Use clay balls and cobblestone slab to craft a kiln. Once placed, you'll need to fire the kiln using a heat source below. Once it's fired, it can cook items. Okay. Well, let's go see if we can find some clay. Um, deep ocean, not usually a good place to find clay. Maybe there's some down here somewhere. I should probably go make myself like a shovel. Is that clay? It is. Perfect. Like it didn't look like it at first, but it looks like it now. Perfect. Got a little bit. Oh, a little bit more right there. Nope, that was sand. I don't want any sand right now, so we'll just put you back. All right, how many did I get? I got 20 of them. That should be enough to start. Let's punch a hole on this side, too, so I can kind of get in and out quickly. All right, cool. So let's look up the kiln and see what the recipe is for that guy. That is clay balls and a cobblestone slab. So is my cobblestone slab recipe the same? Bink, bink, bink. And beat on it with a rock. Yes, it is. All right, cool. So it was you. 
So basically it's a furnace, but instead of all cobblestone, it's a slab in clay. Cool. Got that. So let us... We're going to need to have a heat source outside of it, so I'm not going to do this in my little wood hut. I might try to convert this over to cobblestone before the next night. That's going to bother me. Uh, you know what? Maybe we'll clear out a little area right down here. We'll make a little furnace room. That's where we'll do this. We'll stay in the house. So let's go ahead and clear out just a little area down here. So I got to put a fire under it. So if I put the block there, I can put the kiln right here. Like so. And then I can put a fire block there and they make those fire sticks. Yeah, let's do that. All right, so I need you and some of you. Right, is that how we do it? Like so. And then oh, I'm gonna need two sticks, right? One in each hand, it said. And then I right click. And there we go. Now, if I throw cobble in there, does that work? It doesn't. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, so it had to fire the kiln first. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, so does this turn to stone now? Does it turn to stone? Because I need a couple pieces of stone. I need three pieces of stone to make that grill or grate or whatever it was called. Oh, I was about to. I was literally just about to say it doesn't look like it's working, and then it switched right then. So that was cool. Um, okay, so apparently I need a lot more. This is gonna take. If this is how long it's gonna take to freaking fire up some stone, this could take a while. Let's see. Hopefully I can get like two pieces of this. I guess technically the first one did fire the kiln. So maybe the second one made the, the stone. So maybe I should be able to get two of these done. Hopefully. I'm hoping. Drastically hoping here. All right. And you cook up there. Please, 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 please. I mean, I guess each log burns a little bit different. Sometimes they burn really fast. Sometimes they burn really quick. I mean, uh, like slowly. So <laughs> there we go. I'm going to try to save that piece of wood. <laughs> All right, cool. So we've got the three stone and then I need three rocks. And if I remember correctly, it was one, two, three. And then the gr stones were one, two, three. Was that what it was? Yes, that's what it was. Okay, cool. And how does this work? This thing says upgrade your fire pit with something a bit more great. The grill needs a heat source below it, uh, such as fire to properly cook. Okay. So I guess we'll go put it next to this guy down here and we'll basically do the same thing. And then we'll put you right here. That should work, right? And then I'll need a, a wood block whenever we need to cook. So cool. What other achievements do we have? Um, find salt in dry biomes or riverbeds. Uh, you'll need it for food and curing hides. Um, let's do some more of these. Um, if you want to work, you'll need a work blade. Among many other uses, uh, you may use it to break leaves and rush quickly. Okay, cool. So let's set the work blade. Not work blade, work blade. There it is. That is four flint, one of those strings, and two sticks. All right, so I need to go get more gravel. And get some more flint here. Um... Hmm. I need to do this. Block that off. All right, cool. And then I should be able to get the gravel down here. Like so. What about you? And you. Perfect. I guess I can try to get more of it. Like so. And just prevent that. Perfect. Okay, so we should have a decent amount of flint now. Um, what, I got 12 gravel? Yeah, that should be good. So let's walk into our little hole over here. Schmacky schmack. So it was you and you. There's 12 of those this time. And let's just... Aha, there we go. 
I wish there was a faster way to do this. Got it. All right, tons of those now. So the work blade was, I need more of those fibers. Like so. There we go, that's a decent amount for right now. I wonder if there's a way to get the grass to grow if it grows back, because I'm noticing there's like a texture on the grass itself. So I don't know if they grow back or not. I haven't really seen signs of it, at least not in the house. So we'll see. Um, there's six of those. Okay, so it was one, two, three, four, one, two, and the fiber like that. Perfect. Got it. All right, let's put you back there. All right, so we've got <clears throat> the work blade. Cool. What else do we need to do? Um, a stone pick. Oh, yeah, I can definitely make that now. One, two, three. I guess I don't even need my flint pick anymore. So I'm just going to go toss that away in just a minute. Perfect. And then what else? A spearmint. Um, spearmint. Spear? Spear. Spear is made with a flaked flint and two sticks. Okay. That I can do. Bink, bink. And flaked flint. Like so. Cool. Got that. So we've got a weapon now. That's nice. It's nice to have weapons. Um, let us put some of the stuff away. I'm going to stay organized. The whole series, I'm going to stay organized. Yes. Um, you know what? Just, I was going to throw it, but I'll hold on to it. Oh, look at that. I had more in here. I totally forgot about those. There you go. And let's put the rocks back in here. Let me see. What else am I making first? Um, I just made the spear. Craft a spear for fishing in range combat. I did. Do I need to like use it? I mean, it's like, I already crafted it. Do I need to use it on something like fishing? How do you fish with a spear? Like just throw it in the water and hope you hit something? I don't understand how I'm supposed to... Is there fish in here? Is there like a mod that has fish? I don't see any. That would be... I mean, that'd be cool if there was like a mod that added fish to the game. Hey, what the... Whoa! There are fish! Is that a piranha? You just jump from one to the other? Oh, awesome. Alright, cool. Did that give me the achievement now that I killed a fish? No. Crafting a spear for fishing in ranged combat. I did. I just went fishing with it. Oh, there's another piece of gravel. How else do I accomplish that? I just did it. I, I made it. I used it. Oh, that might have been silly about me. Okay, got it back. Cool. Um, I mean, I don't... Ay, ay, ay. Let's, let's close this place up and figure this out. I just went fishing with it. I caught myself a piranha. Ooh, I can cook food now. Um, so, does that go... Oh, it does. Oh, okay. Look at that. Nicey nice. Now, how long does this take? And how many can I cook at once? I don't know. I like the particle effects. Those are really cool. Like actual smoke coming out of the fire and stuff. That's that's pretty sweet. And it looks like it might just be one at a time. But that's a good start. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Let's make up a few more of these fibers. Put them away. Wood away. I guess we can put our flint like right here. And I'll put some gravel over there. And some stone right there. Okay, cool. <clears throat> so, I don't know what else to do. Oh, oh, okay. Now I see it. I didn't get credit for this because I haven't done this one. Okay. Left click a bone on a block like cobblestone. Okay, I haven't got a bone yet. So, can't do that. But what else can we do? Uh, find and enter abyssal craft dark biome. Is that what that dark biome is over there? Is that... A pistol craft? Can I do that really quick? Okay, we can do that. Not now. We're going to wait for the sun to come back up. But 
Uh, acquire a shadow gem from shadow creatures uh, residing in the Darklands. Uh, smaller creatures have smaller gems, while larger, the more dangerous shadow. Okay. Forever fire. Oh, this sounds good. Low grade charcoal blocks are a great source of charcoal, and you can light a fire on top of that. Will never go out. Ooh. Low grade charcoal. I can handle that. A piece of wood in the kiln. Although I don't have any wood. Hmm. <gasps> I know how to do this. Thank you. I'll swap these two out. Do I still have any torches left? No, I put all three up. Um, if I take you, of course I can't get to you. <sighs> all right. And I put you here instead and put you inside. And I need more sticks. I need more sticky sticks. Which means, oh, I can take a plank, can't I? On this thing and make sticks? Isn't that what it said? Yeah, I'm learning. I've got this under control. All right, so hopefully I click on you. You turn this into low grade charcoal and I can just swap it out. Right, is that how that's gonna work? Please, come on. You can do it. I love the smoke particles. That's really, really cool. Um, that did not successfully work. Let us try that again. I've got these planks right here. I've got two. So one is going to be for fire and I'm not even going to have enough sticks. Huh. I'm going to need... I don't know why I'm hearing water way up here. There's no water up here. Or maybe down there. I guess it's kind of close. Um, let's run over here and get some wood real quick. Let's, oh, you know, I haven't even tried Bane Miner. Uh, excavate, modify, or the enchantment on your tool to be able to excavate. Okay. So it was a good shot, but they've got that locked down. All right, bink, bink. Let's go try this again. So you... I'm at that close to the water right here. Is that what it is? I don't know. Um, oh, but I need more sticks. More stickies. Chop, chop, chop. Got you. All right. Like so. There's four of those bad boys. All right, cool. So if I need to do you. Hopefully this will make that low-grade charcoal, and then we won't have to keep doing this. Right? You can do it. I know you can. I know you can. Come on, baby. Low grade charcoal me up. Oh, yeah. All right, cool. And oh, don't want to do that because I'll just break it and it'll go away. All right, so we're going to put you down there like that. Right. And then we're going to put another one in here. I need to put you in my hand. And then I got an extra one. Good thing I made extra. And so that fire should stay permanent now, right? That's what it's telling me, right? And then I can put another one right here and put my grate back up. Or grill, stone grill. So we'll put you like that. That water splashing sound. I got I must be really close to the water right here. Uh come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Cool. Now will you spread if I put if I put you here, will you just spread over there? I don't know. We'll leave you there for a second and we'll see. And as a matter of fact, I want a couple more pieces of stone. Because I'm going to kind of close this in. I don't like it floating like this. I want it to look like it's actually on the ground. So I'm going to fill this in with stone right here. <clears throat> but if that burns, that's awesome. So that burns forever. So that was achievement done, right? Yes. Yes, it is. All right, cool. So what else do we do? Uh, we've got a bladder than nothing. No buckets. Use a fluid batter, bladder to craft with. Um, the hand grindstone isn't quick by any means. But it will let you grind stuff up easily. All right. Well, that's some stuff to look at. Why haven't you turned to stone yet? Why do you take... Oh, jeez, that takes a long time. All right. So I want to put you here just to kind of keep it looking pretty. This wood still hasn't burnt. Maybe I should just make some sticks. <laughs> Maybe that's what I should do. So put you there. And then make up some sticks like so there we go 
and then we'll light this one up too. There we go. And bingo bango light you up. Perfect. And take you out. And you're gonna go right there. Cool, so I can just kind of leave those like that, right? And then this can be continued down towards the mining. Ooh, what's this? What's that? There's all these nifty blocks, but I don't have Wyla. I just now realized I don't have Wyla. What is that? Slate. What are you? Marble. Okay. So this is just chisel mod stuff. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Still nighttime, so we're not getting a lot done right now. Let us just throw you guys out for a second. I don't really need you at the moment, and that's just going to take up some inventory space that is obviously going to take a minute before we can get some. Let us look at, well, let's see if there's any storage things. Um, storage upgrades. Okay, so there's the chest. A uh, hopper. I mean, I don't really have a need for a hopper yet, but um, let's look up hopper. It's an achievement I might be able to do. Wooden hopper. It's a chest with five wooden planks. And then mark two is the hopper with some bark and a cobweb. Now I'm definitely nowhere near there, but I can do this one. So I needed a rock and a lot more wood. It's, it's, it's late. It's, it's in the middle of the night. Uh, let's go out to this side. Let's peek around a little bit. Anybody? Nobody, nobody wants to mess with me, right? Come check out. There's a horse over there. Why are the horses safe, but I'm not. What's up with that? All right. Let's get some wood so we can make a hopper. I don't think there's anything I can really kind of start to want to automate now. <coughs> I mean, I guess if it worked in the kiln, but then how would I take out of the kiln? Well, I guess that we could just always put ones in. And then if I ever need one, just grab it. And I guess that could be a kind of an automation set for, for the moment. I don't know what I would really need to hop, but it's worth thinking about. All right, cool. So let's get back in here, close you up. And I need, I need what, eight of you? Yeah, eight plus five. I need 13 of you. getting two per right so I need like what seven of these how many do I got I got 13 oh that's exactly how I needed right okay cool so stone was in the middle it's a little like the other series but instead of twine and okay so there's the chest okay and then one two three four five like that all right cool we got a hopper i'm not exactly sure oh you know how this could be useful hold on if i do this and then put wood in here okay it it doesn't have a gooey um do i just throw it in there oh it worked that's really cool okay so do that right and then I can just sit here and do this. Oh, look how fast I can make planks now. I mean, not like it was a really hard process, but that's cool. That that's I think that's a pretty efficient way to do that. I like that. Okay, cool. And then we've got daylight again. Okay. So what were some of the other things we wanted to go, but I couldn't go do this. We're gonna go take a look over at the Abyssal Craft area. Because that was an achievement we needed. Um, find and enter an abyssal craft dark biome and then dark gem I'm not really ready to fight yet by any means but at least I can go check out the biome I mean it just says I have to enter it, it just says enter the dark biome what is this biome next to it though that biome, I like the light colors the, like the, the pretty teal colors that's, that's cool alright let's get my spear out and ready what biome is this? Um, wow, I just, there's no coordinates. 
There's no biome. There's no northeast, south, or west. Um, hmm. Well, that's interesting. But I think this is Darklands over here, right? That's what this is. I barely remember um, Abyssalcraft from my... Ah, see, end of the area. Okay, cool. That is the right area. I kind of remember Abyssalcraft. This wood just looks cool. From my Revenge of the Sea Team days. My axe is broke. Um, I can't make another one of those on me, can I? Oh, yeah, I can. Um, I got two sticks. I don't have any flint on me. I have no flint. Um, wow, this is really cool. Like These are like glow-in-the-dark over here. This is a really cool looking biome, actually. It's just kind of scary looking, but there's chickens. Hi, Mr. Chickens. I'm going to let you guys live because I don't have a need for you guys right now. This is a really cool looking biome. Like these bright flowers in here and it's just like kind of dark and the sky's grayed out when you're in it. That's really cool. Well, cool. We, we, we got that achievement done. That was probably the easiest achievement we'll have. Oh, wheat. I can take you. Go get a farm started pretty soon. Nothing else really growable. Ooh. Slow down on that stuff. All right. Let's get across here. I'm digging this. I am really digging this. It's definitely a slow play start. I mean, we're 45 minutes in and I haven't got a lot accomplished. Like by now in regular modern Minecraft, I'd have like, you know, a rocket ship already. Um, so I'm digging the slow play of it. I'm, I like the crafting mechanics that it has. I think that's way more realistic. So I'm now understanding the comment that I saw about, um, you know, like the way Minecraft should be. I'm, I'm kind of a, a partial to agree with that now. Um, I probably going to need another chest or two. Probably. Let me, let me grab these and I have rocks on me. No, because I just put them back. There we go. So let's go ahead and do you. Bink, bink, bink. I don't know why I bink. Every time I hear myself do that, I'm like, why, do, why am I binking? What is binking? Cool. And let's do another one, just in case. Oh, you know what? We've got enough to make two more. Let's make two more. We'll have four total chests. I'm okay with that. <clears throat> hey, get back in there. All right. And bink, bink, bink. Not binking. I'm not binking anymore. I'm not going to do that. I mean, I'll still do it eventually, but I'm thinking about it right now. All right, cool. So we'll go ahead and put these chests right here on this wall. And I don't want to put one right there. You know what? This I might put down by the other ones. Although I don't like the fact that it didn't seem to cook anything but food. That was an interesting thing. <clears throat> all right. So this is all highly usable stuff. Okay. Hey, get back in there. Get back in there. Um, anything else on me? Yeah, let's put the stone in here too. I said stone, not that. There we go. Now, this is going to be something for food and stuff, as well as farming once we hit that point. And more oak saplings can go right there where you belong. Um, clay. Clay is useful stuff. Um more useful than dirt <laughs> definitely more useful than dirt and that technically could be farmland so there we go um the one plank i'm not too worried about i got a couple apples all right let's look at what else we gotta do okay so it looks like the next obvious things would be grind it in the bladder so bladder than nothing fluid bladder let's look that up fluid bladder it takes three of the twine which we got we need an ink sack and two brown dye. Brown dye can be done from black dye and orange dye or red and yellow. How do we get these? Well, red and yellow, obviously. How do I get that? A millstone, which I don't think we can do. Or the grindstone. Okay. So let's look at the grindstone first instead. Um, oh, yeah. I know what that's what it was. Grindstone. What is this? This is six pieces of stone and a stick. So let's do it. Um, you know, I want to make another one of these hoppers, actually. I do want to make another one of these hoppers and I want to put it above the kiln and see if it auto populate the kiln. Because if it does that, then I can make like, you know, whenever I need stone, I can just, oh, you know what? I don't have a workable axe. I should be able to make a vanilla axe now. So let's 
grab you. And I have sticks. I do have two sticks. Okay. One, two, three, like so. And hopefully I'll never have to worry about the flint tools ever again. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I kind of want to like save you because you know what? You were my first thing I built, I made. I want to hold on to you. So, all right. So let's go get some more wood. Try to make another one of those hoppers. And then we'll put it above the kiln. And then we can kind of automate stone as well. Um, I can go up here. There we go. That looks really crazy. Like you can't even tell if you're hitting wood or not because of the the whatever's modding these trees. All right, let's go get a little more wood. I have six. Each one gives me two, which is 12. I need to make, I know what, 13 I think it was. So this is more than enough wood. Good. Couple saplings, couple more. Okay, let's get this done. We have about 10 minutes left. I think we can do this. Um, so let me just like that. There we go. And let's go to town. It's hitting the hopper. Come on. Good grief. Oh, and I picked up the wood. That's what I was trying not to do. Um, come on. Get all in there. All right. Oh, jeez. This could get annoying since it doesn't actually technically go in. I'll just stay back and pick them all up when I'm done. I think that sounds like a better idea. All right, cool. Plenty of wood. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And do I have rocks on me? Nope, they're right there. There we go. And make you. And then it was one, two, three, four, five. And the chest. <clears throat> cool. Now let's go make some auto stone real quick. So I'm going to dig you out. Like that. Cool. Put the hopper there. And <clears throat> I mean, how am I supposed to get, I can do it right here. Like that. And I can just throw the stone in here like this. Let's try that again. I can just throw the stone in there like that. And there we go. Then it auto populates into there. And then whenever I need a stone, I can just come by and grab it. Okay. I like that. I mean, it's not the most advanced thing in the world, but I mean, it's a start. Get in there. There you go. And there you go. And then I just take it out whenever I need stone. Ah, I like that. I like that. I like it. Now, what else can we do? Oh, I need six of those. That's why I was making stone. I need six stone. So there's one, there's two. <clears throat> this could take a while. <laughs> These, I mean, it's cool and all, but it seems like there could be quicker ways to uh, make stone, but it really is in keeping with the whole, like, you know, slow roll beginning, which I actually do appreciate. I do like that. So I'm totally okay with it. Not that I have a choice if I'm not okay with it, but it's a, it's a little slower than I might like to get started, but it's okay. I'm really digging the, the, the smoke effect. I know I've said it a couple times now, but it's just really cool. Um, I wonder, can I just, oh, what, what exactly are you doing on there? Okay. Can I put cobble? Can I put you back together? No, I can't. Okay. Um, there's my six. Okay. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six. And I had a stick, right? Yep. And there's the grindstone. Okay, cool. Now I needed this so we could make, I'm going to have to branch this out a little bit. We're going to need a little more room. We're going to need to make our house a little bit bigger. If you want to call this a house. <laughs> oh, it's almost nighttime, which means three Minecraft days have passed. And that means time is running out for today's episode. All right, let's go like this. Just a little room. I don't need a lot of room right now. 
And you know what? When I'm inside, that corner won't bug me, so. Oh, that was perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And let me put my torch back up. I'll put it right here. All right, so grindstone, you go right there. And you know what? I'll put you back down just because. Okay. So I'm sure I'm going to need to go grab some dice. Let me, let me go grab, see if there's any like, do these, I wonder if these flowers work. I wonder. Let's, that one looks black and this one looks orange. Okay. So if I was to bet if there's any flowers that I could use without having to do the other ones, these would be the ones. What are these? Black Lotus. That makes sense. Tall orange. If there was the right ones, I think I grabbed them. Let's see. It goes on. It spins. But does it give me a black die? It does. Awesome. So at least we've got the dies going. And then I needed twine. And I'm going to need an ink sack. But I haven't seen any. Is that orange dye? Is that what that is? Cool. Orange dye powder, black dye powder. We've got that. Um, if I crack those, I should get two brown, right? Yeah. Now we just need, we need an ink sack, but I have not noticed any squid around. So that could be a challenge and it is late. So this could be, this could be really stupid. No, I'm not going to do that until I get back. I'm going to go venture around and see if we can find some squiddies. I've got my spear. Hopefully I just don't see any mobs. I mean, I haven't seen any except for that weird one. Um, and then I say that and then here comes a purple creeper. What exactly is a purple creeper? Can I throw my spear at you? Oh, it hit him. All right. So you could, uh, didn't seem to do a lot of damage, but it hit him. Let's go back and get my spear. I need that back. There it is. Can I use the spear like a sword too? I mean, that's how spears work. I can, but he's going to blow. Yeah, I was like, he's going to blow right there. I didn't get away. Whoa. Oh, he like left a freaking potion on the ground. Well, good thing I wasn't anywhere near that when he blew. Okay. So, see, I hear the sounds in the water. Whoa, what was that? I saw something. I saw something. Um, and there's a spider over there. You stay over there. Squids. I'm looking for squids. What I might do is pause right here until we get a squid. So at least I can get the bladder done and all that. So what I might do is go run and hide <laughs> until daytime. I'll come back out, find a squid. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Where did you all come from? What are you? Stay away. Stay away from me. Yes, I'm going to go hide in my house. Oh, it's another creeper. Yes, we're going to hide in here until morning. And then we'll go uh, search for a squid when the sun comes back up. Because that was just stupid. All right. We'll be back shortly. I thought I'd show you this guy. It's called a trumpet skeleton. And he keeps blowing his horn at me. But I'm thinking if I get that bone, I can get some more uh, achievements done. If he drops a bone. He didn't. Oh, he did. Cool. Let's, let's get that real quick. Let's get back in here now. I just, I heard the trumpet sound. And I kind of wanted to show you guys that. Because I thought that was kind of funny. I... No, no, no. I didn't get the hole filled in time. <laughs> um, yeah, that sucked. Let's get this built back up. Sad day for me. And I don't have any of the wood. Okay, I'm going to have to build my house back up. And it looks like all my chests are gone. I got two chests back um i lost my grindstone i lost my fire pit okay so i got some building to do so i guess you know what i'll be doing for the there was something here what was here what was oh that was a chest that chest blew up too oh man all right well i guess it's it's, it's back to the grindstone and trying to get uh my stuff back so yeah we'll be back shortly all right guys so daytime's back i got a built back up pretty quickly i did find out that olives are bad um they got my health back up and then they gave me nausea and then went right back down really really quickly so i'm not a big fan of the olives but i'm just finishing putting my stuff back in here and then we can go 
and chase down a squiddy, hopefully not get blown up again. It is daytime now, so shouldn't be as big of an issue. But I really want to get the squiddy, get this bladder done. And do I have more? Yeah, I've got those on me. I just don't see a squid anywhere. I mean, it'd be not, what was that down there? What's this? I don't know this material. Oh, salt. Oh, cool. That's cool. I'm just constantly looking because I know there's going to be a lot of new things. So I'm constantly looking out for things that don't look norm. And that one was one of them. And I was accurate in my assessment that it wasn't normal. <clears throat> and I got an achievement for it. So cool. So we are going to go find a squiddy somewhere. There's got to be some somewhere. I think I just saw a fish over here. What is this? What's going on here? I don't know. Squiddies. Here, squiddy squiddies. Um, it's like so far the only thing I've seen in the water is a piranha. What is this? Lily pad with something under it. What's well, different? Um, I see fish. Right, they're going up and down and doing their thing. Which I should probably go do some fishing because I do need some food. But let's see. What is this? Um, yeah, whatever it is, it slows me down. Ah, squiddies. Yes. Come here, squiddies. I need your ink. I need your ink. Come here. One of you guys. You. You're the one. You're the one. Oh, they actually pop ink. That's so funny. And it gives you blindness. That's that, I mean, that's very realistic. I like that. That's a great addition. Annoying, yeah, but still a pretty cool addition. Did I get ink? I did. I got my ink set. Cool. So we can go make that bladder and then we'll call it a day and get started uh, next time. Well, obviously where we left off. So let's get back. Er, run. Run. Faster. Actually, probably shouldn't be using up my uh, saturation like that. But anyways, I you guys tell me what you think. I'm digging this. I think this is a really cool pack. I think the slow start is a little kind of bit annoying. But at the same time, I think it's far more realistic. And I'm definitely agreeing with the comment. Oh, there's a squiddy down there too. Um, I'm agreeing with the comment that I saw, which interests me in the first place. That this is, I think, a great... To say this is how Minecraft start should start... It's a little stretch, but I agree with the premise. Like, this is a lot, I think, more fun in the sense of it's just not like, you know, grab a piece, punch a piece of wood. Like, you can't punch a tree. That's just nonsense. Um, I need you, you, and was it three of you? Is that what it was? I think that's what it was. One, two, three. And it was brown, brown, and ink in the middle. Please tell me I did that right. Yes. So we got the bladder. Cool. And I'm just going to go test this out, but I have a feeling it works like a bucket. Let's get, see. Is that, y'all see that? That's a damn shark. A damn shark in this little lagoon. Where did you come from? If you weren't here before, you can't just magically appear. It doesn't work that way. You have to swim into it. Oh, and he's coming after me. Well, I'm out of here. You can stay there and do your thing, man. I'm, I'm taking off. Oh, yeah. I was trying to get water, though. <laughs> Let's at least do that. Oh. Oh, I can't put it back down? Apparently, there's not infinite water in this game. That's good to know. No infinite water. Um, but, okay. So, we got a fluid bladder. Contains water. 100 millibuckets. Awesome. Temperature 300K. Added by Minecraft. Interesting. All right. Cool. So, we've got that complete... So I think this is a pretty darn good start. You know what? While we're at it, let me do this. Come back here, bone. Okay, cool. And then I got the spearmint achievement too as well. Cool. So yeah, getting that and I got the spear. So got a couple more, some fishing and stuff like that, which I've already done, but we can go do more. So that'll be some stuff to look in into the next episode. Um, I don't know what I, oh, the bladder opened up. Ooh, bed boys, bed boys. This is something we want to look into. Shake, rattle, and roll. Craft the Yeah, we're going to look at that next time. So, 
Is it, if this is something you guys want to see more of, please, by all means, let me know down in the comments. I do appreciate the likes. It just helps me get a few more views because the more likes, the more chances other people are having a chance to see the video. And that kind of motivational for me to do, you know, to interact with more of you guys. So anyways, I'm going to go do some fishing and uh, try to like get my stock up real quick. And then did I get him? Did I get him? I don't think I got him. I think I got hit by something though. Oh, Piranhas. Piranhas again. Get me away from the piranhas. Alright, anyways. Y'all know the deal. I'm Slaughter Havoc, and I am out of here. Peace!